Beloved Brothers and Sisters on Earth. The first video in this series focused upon where, who, and how. Now, the historical legacy and foundations of the church. The roots of Taitama Truth Foundation, Family of Your Eye, and Church of the Creator are anchored in the heavens part of the foregoing and ongoing unfoldment of God's divine plan, part of the greater plan, divine directives administered through the Creator's heavenly hierarchy, the office of the Christ coordinated by the orders of Michael, Metatron, and Melchizedek, has the responsibility and administrative authority in the hierarchy of heavenly government to bring about the necessary purifications and consciousness evolvement on this planetary sphere and its fallen universe. Known and unknown avatars of humanity in all fields and disciplines have had representatives of their life streams in consciousness of this collective effort. Encouraged is your review as a registered user of the materials published. Recorded history has not always given credence to the supporting role within and behind the scenes. There is always a support group, spiritual, physical, family, hierarchical, family tree. Individuals, counterparts of witness, who behold in perfection the star figure in their part, pact, thus giving the one allowance to be about the father's business and creating in the midst of duality the necessary buffer mechanisms. Through prayer and unfoldment, this part so obscure has been performed through the love of the heart, always present to maintain the purity. The mother of this organization birthed through her, Reverend Dr. Grace Marama Uri. Her earthly legacy are the foundation, principles, and practices of the church. Space of grace, parables and prose, the father's songs to his children, creator daughter's eon, sacred mandate, Taitama Truth Foundation, family of your eye incorporated, articles of faith and constitution, church of the creator, Ecclesia Magna Carta, Consecration, Dispensation, Grids of Consciousness Unification, Activation of Divine Law Intervention Through the Divine Receivership, Dispensation of 1969, The Tool, Decree of Divine Right Order. The foundation stones on which we build bear witness to her legacy. Her unending effort, demonstration by example, beholdance of others, and unconditional love are the mortar that is the mother. This messenger has personal experience wherein and whereof I speak, present since the late summer of 1976 co-creating with a feminine aspect and balance since that first day of meeting the founder of this church, through her life and living, through joining with others, and in my life now, ongoing and present, the balance of my beloved wife, Angela Magdalene Uri, in her unconditional love and beholdance. What's important for each of us and for you is to apply these principles in the now that will return us to the divine blueprint held within the Holy Trinity, divine deity, our parent, creator, source, the family, and operating on earth, the father, the mother, the sister, the brother, the son, the daughter, and truth, the mates of our being, where every voice and every part counts. To that end, for you, who you are and who you represent, join with me 
add your voice. Speak the words. Beloved and holy parent, we ask assistance and adjustment so that we may utilize our God essence energy in collective, coordinated co-creation within and through the office of the Christ. We decree divine right order. Kadoish, 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 Adonai, Sabayoth. Divine right order. Kadoish, 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 Adonai, Sabayoth. Divine right order. Kadoish, 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 Adonai, Sabayoth. Be ready. Selah. This church, this functioning body decrees that as long as it may serve this planet, this humanity, so therefore are we prepared to be the instruments in which to serve the one living God who has placed the trust in us. So be it, and so it is. Amen, 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 and amen.